So hey guys, thanks for stopping by and checking out another one of my videos. Um, this is the Lo-Fi Looper. And this is basically based off of the Cowlacious um, PCB board for the ISD chip quarter chip. Essentially, this chip inside here um, allows you to record 60 seconds of audio. So I put it into a pedal and um, added a record playback switch a loop locking switch and then a trigger switch which also will trigger the loop but also triggers the recording process as well. On the pedal I put an input control, there is a reset switch to erase the loop and start over, there's a very simple um, low pass filter tone control which is better actually for guitar than with the OP-1 and then an output control. But let me show you how this works. So I put this into record mode and we've got uh, some basic drum beats. Okay, so I can hit this to record. Okay, and then I put this into playback mode. And I can trigger the loop here, or I can lock the loop on here. See, it's a very lo-fi and gritty. I'm going to stop the loop, I'm going to reset that, do it again. I'm going to turn the input gain up all the way so we can hear a really distorted uh, recording. So you get the idea. You can also use it with chords. So let me put it on. So we'll do we'll do this one. I'm just going to record a really short loop after the attack. Turn the input gain down. Reset that. Put it in record mode. Okay, so now when we set this to play back, it'll just be a little piece of that chord. So there's no way to adjust the loop speed or anything like that. It's very simple. It's just a quick lo-fi grab and capture. So let's do that same chord again, and I'm going to turn the input gain all the way up, which allows you to distort the chip. So in this way, if you record a short loop, you can actually get kind of a, a gritty distorted tone that if you're doing something like dream pop or alternative music, it's um, a little bit more useful. Reset this, put it in record mode, same chord. Okay, so now playback. So here it's very gritty. Now see the loop trigger works like this. It'll play the loop from start to finish. So let's reset that and try a chord change. So if I turn the input gain down again, here I can get a much cleaner sounding um, loop.
Okay, so here's an example of the lo-fi looper with the guitar. And um, I've got a Klon buffer pedal here to strengthen the guitar signal. So we can try and record this in a, a couple different ways. So first, we'll just do the, the um, record as this switch is held down. Set this to record. So I will do um, a capture after I strum the strings. So you can capture just a, a piece of a loop, but the other thing you can do with this is instead of triggering the record process with the momentary switch, you can trigger it with the other switch and then kind of record your playing and it will keep recording until you hit the switch again. <clears throat> so let's try that. Reset it. Put it to record mode. And then we'll do... Okay, so <clears throat> now we've got... <clears throat> excuse me, we've got a piece of the loop recorded. So anyways, that's really it. That's the Lo-Fi Looper, um, the Calacious chip you can get online. You can get it in lengths up to 120 seconds, so two minutes. Um, it's typically used in haunted houses where um, essentially when I'm hitting loop start here, that's just a simple trigger. I'm closing a switch that's on the board. And in haunted houses, they'll have you step on a, a sensor, which will trigger the start of a scary loop or something like that. Um, you can actually wire up infrared sensors and all kinds of things to trigger this. This loop switch actually just, instead of um, this being a momentary switch, this just holds the switch. It creates a permanent connection uh, while you have the switch on. So pretty cool, pretty excited about it. Um, I didn't know if it would work actually, in all honesty, and uh, it works great. So totally lo-fi, not a lot of uh, dynamic purposes to this. But if you're just looking for something creative in the studio to kind of capture a texture and uh, play over the top, this might be your guy. Anyways, thanks for stopping by and checking out another video. Catch you next time.